It is time for more Minecraft bingo, this time the 25-minute points challenge, seed 3, 4, 5, 6. And there is, I think if I counted correctly, 33 iron and uh, 13 gold that one would need. And so a lot of mining underground on this one, as well as a couple of cows and some swampy kind of items. Uh, if one's going to try to go after everything... So let's try to get our initial tools and get down into a good deep cave as quickly as possible, I think. But let's get started. Start go! And that is what I will do. I will start and I will go. It looks like we're kind of on a kind of narrow bit of land over here and one has to travel uh, a little ways to get into more of a continent. And so I'm going to do that. And just so that I don't forget about it, I'm also going to grab three pieces of sand from here before I get my shovel. Uh, but then we're going to head over in this direction and get the exposed stone that's over here and then continue on kind of into what looks like a bigger continent over here that might also be extreme hills. Uh, and extreme hills could be extremely good from the point of view of giving us an extra shot at getting some emeralds. But first up... Let's do some of the usual crafting stuff. So I'll try to do this and fast forward. Alrighty, and I went ahead and cooked up my sand into my glass bottles. And while that's finishing up, I'm gonna grab some extra cobble. While the crafting table is still down, I'm going to go ahead and make those, discard the remnants. Oops. <laughs> wrong tool, wrong tool. And we still need to find some food. Uh, there is some coal right here that's probably actually worth getting, and so let's grab that. And some extra blocks that don't hurt either. Uh, but we definitely want to find some food and then find our way down into a cave system. As I said at the beginning, I see some delicious food packets walking around coated in white fur right over here. <laughs> Hello, sheep. Come become my dinner. And yeah, we'll go ahead and grab some more dirt blocks as we gather some sheep. Oh, and some cows. Great, because I need two pieces of leather for this card. Um, and I don't, I got one piece of leather there and I do hear another cow around. They usually come in groups. Uh, is that you? Yeah, there you are. Great. Uh, we're going to need a fair amount of... Okay, I don't know if that cow gave me what I needed. We're going to need a fair amount of um, coal for all the smelting we need to do. Uh, speaking of, let's go ahead and get some of that going. Where's the other cow? Here he is. Because I still think I need the leather. And then while that food is cooking up, let's also... I think that should be enough wood for all the various crafting things that we'll need and whatnot. Um, and while I'm here, uh, do I have both of the pieces of leather at this point? Uh, I do. And so let's make the item frame, and then let's remember that we're going to need a book, and so I'm going to need to find some sugar cane. All right, and then I will pick my crafting table back up um, and realize that I've fallen in a hole. And uh, four pieces is great. Okay, we've got some good food already cooked up. Let's go find that cave. Uh, and actually, there's a chance um, we need to find a brick. Uh, is there any... Um, I don't see the, uh, the gray stuff, the clay, uh, right over there. There's a chance that we're going to be crafting a golden apple. And since there's some swamp trees over here, I also see some mushrooms. Uh, let's actually... Here's what I should be doing. Uh, since I'm going to be sticking around here a little bit longer. Uh, let's go ahead and get a little bit more of that cooking. Let's go ahead and get that on the usual space in the bar. And let's see if we can gather up the um, uh, mushroom that I need, as well as... It seems like there's one other thing from the surface. Right, the sugar cane. Uh, so let's see if we can find a red mushroom, and let's chop down as many trees as we can and try to get the apple. And so I kind of wasted a little bit of time getting wood earlier because I didn't think about the apple possibilities in terms of getting the wood. Oh, well. Um, all right. But this will be uh, with two swamp trees and two big trees. I think we have a good chance. 
of getting what we need. So let's look around and see if there's a red mushroom. It might be found in the taiga. We might see it over here. It's also, I see sugar cane over here. Um, it's a little ways off, but it's the only sugar cane I see right now. We can also keep an eye out for any caves that might be over in this direction. Not seeing any caves. Uh, but I will run over here. I'm gonna grab the sugar cane. We're gonna go back to our trees. Hopefully, uh, we'll have gotten lucky and gotten an apple. There it's the sugar cane. And I may also need sugar for the cake. The cake is a pretty unlikely possibility. I don't see any uh, pumpkins anywhere on the horizon either. Pumpkin seeds are also on this card. Oh, uh, but I do hear a zombie right here. And a skeleton. Let's quickly just take a look and see. Uh, those leaves can continue despawning for a little while. Might just be normal monsters. Are they louder down here? I don't hear any monsters multiplying there. I hear like one skeleton and one zombie, so... Wrong tool, wrong tool! You have to shuffle on the bar, Brian! So I think we will decide that that was not actually a spawner, uh, nor an all too impressive cave system. I wasn't able to find it that easily. Uh, so we'll go back here. We're still looking for the red mushroom. Okay, great. We got the apple. Um, and we got some more food. Oh, we got apples galore. We got apples up the wing wang. Who would have thunk it? Let's continue looking for the things that we need on the surface. Um... Still no red mushrooms in sight. I've got plenty of good food, and so I can probably afford to kind of sprint jump uh, most everywhere as I am traveling. Yeah, 10 stakes, even with a lot of jumping, I think, should get me through the whole thing. And I've got a little bit of extra uh, raw beef if needed. I'm not seeing pumpkins. A jungle is another thing that we need to find for a couple of different items. There is the uh, Glistering Melon, as well as the Cookie, I believe, are both on this card. Ah, I saw the orange, and I was hoping that it was going to be the pumpkin, but instead it was a lava pool. And I still haven't found... haven't noticed a good cave opening. It's possible that I've passed one. All right, but we're just going to continue to run, continue to be on the lookout. Possibly might have just passed a little cave opening over there. Uh, but I don't mind continuing to look. Let's look out for red for the mushroom. Let's look out for orange. Uh, I think I might have seen a pumpkin up here. Um, all right, we don't want to go that way. Uh, there is a cave right here. How good is this cave looking? Oh, crap. All right, well, it's looking pretty good. Oh, it's a ravine. Um, I don't have a bucket yet. Um, I could just jump down there. That'll get us down to nice levels. Let's take a risk. Sploosh! All right, great. I don't even have an iron pick yet. Um, but I expect that that will remedy itself very shortly. Because here is three or more iron. Oops, accidentally brought broken extra piece of cobblestone. One thing that I'm often wondering about um, is how much time people kind of uh, waste mining blocks that don't need to be mined, uh, such as cobblestone. And I've been really trying to focus on only breaking kind of the correct blocks uh, when possible, but it is surprisingly hard to do. All right, uh, we're going to get the iron pick momentarily. Um, I'm also planning to... Uh, well, let's get some blocks in the bar. I was going to say I'm also planning to... Let's also just have some torches... Uh, in case we need to light up a spawner right here, a bunch of zombies around. Um, make a bucket, and so I'm leaving that water source there. That was finishing me, the, the uh, almost planning to. <laughs> in case you're wondering where make a bucket came out of all of a sudden. And I saw some gold and some more iron up here, and so we're going to build a staircase uh, up to somewhere. All right, this is just a little cave. Okay, there's more gold in here as well. And I should have made another furnace. That would have been a smart thing to do. Uh, but I didn't do it yet. And we will have plenty of opportunities to smelt later on. I'm going to need to kill some spiders if we see them around here. The zombies, obviously, I don't really care about because they're not going to drop anything good for us. Uh, but let's do this. Let's get more iron in here. 
Let's make another furnace. I need to get some redstone down here. I don't know that we're quite deep enough for that yet. Um, and just to get that going, but let's get some more uh, coal. Just because I like coal for such things. Um, actually, that'll be enough to... Oh, what am I talking about? I've chopped down all these trees. I've got plenty of wood that I can use uh, as kind of like extra smoky fuel. Okay. Um, right. We're still going to need more gold. And there's more gold up here, and we're still going to need more iron, and there's more iron all around. And I hear my spider. Great. Uh, so let's try to get the spider eye from him, and also to string. Uh, it sounds like the spider is around the corner to the left over here. Hey, spider pro. Where you at? You over here? Sounds like you are. All right, tons of gold around. Great. Um, here's some other mobs. Okay, there's the spider. He was somewhat forthcoming. I don't think there's any gunpowder on this one, and so I can uh, continue to suck at uh, fighting these guys, and it won't matter. Here, help me out, brother. There you go. Thanks. Uh, what was I trying to... Oh, you didn't kill the skeleton. I thought that explosion was going to be close enough to the skeleton to kill him, and it was not. All right. Well, we'll do that. Um, at this point, I'm pretty sure... I've already gotten, I think, one more iron vein will be sufficient for the number of iron that I need to get. And we might actually find some iron, so I should focus on the gold. Uh, we might actually find some iron and some spawner. Ah ha 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 ha! Here is... I need better blocks in the bar. There was a uh, diamond hoe. Uh, and so we're gonna get the two diamonds right here. So that's super awesome, and I see some redstone right over here. Um, I don't have that bucket yet. Let's actually get a bucket of water. That'll make this a whole lot safer and easier. Make me feel better. Um, let's go ahead and craft the diamond hoe. Great. Uh, get half of this in here and half of this in here. Let's make my bucket, uh, which might be used for a cake later on. How are we doing on time? Eh, still pretty good. Uh, let's eat some more food. I see the creeper down here. I'm not going to bother mining more diamonds for a diamond pick. It's always kind of tempting when you see this many uh, diamonds around, but I'm not going to do it. I am going to get to the gold and the redstone that I need, and I'm going to be aware of the fact there's a creeper chasing me. Oh, crap, oh, crap. <laughs> All right, the creeper isn't actually chasing me, which is fortunate, because uh, if I'd taken more damage there, I'd probably be dead. Um, but I'm very happy with my decision uh, to get that water bucket. I think that it was a very wise decision, um, and we're all happy. Oh crap! I don't want to die. Okay, I'm safe for the moment. Uh, is there anything else that I can do while I am here? Yes, we have the materials for a compass, no, a clock, uh, which is one of the items on the card. And so let's go ahead and craft that as we heal up. Uh, and then we'll try to get rid of the skeleton before we try to reascend the rest of the gold from which we can uh, get the golden apple. And at this point, I'm pretty sure I can take on the skeleton if I can find him. Uh, so let's just try to get eyes on him. Um, he must be up here somewhere. Here's another spider, and we still never got the what do you call, so let's go for that. There's my spider eye, great. And then this gold that I was trying to kind of pillar up to uh, is right up here. Actually, I can get it from over here, probably. So let's do that. And let's see. I need eight more gold and one more gold. I need nine more gold. <laughs> I can add um, in order to make the golden apple and the um, glistering melon. And I think there might be enough here. Uh, is that going to fall? No, I put out the lava over here. And so it's okay if this falls in the ground. Skeleton, I still hear somewhere. I don't see him, but you know what? That's okay. Sometimes you don't need to see the skeleton. Sometimes hearing them is enough. All right, and I'm going to do this, and now I've got my hearts back, and so I can afford to take the fall damage. I'm going to go, bro, crap, pick No! Oh, gosh, no. Uh, can I get out of here? There we go. See, everything's fine. Why do people worry? 
all just fine and dandy. Uh, let's get half this cooking over here and half this cooking over here. Uh, I don't actually need all of it. Let's take a look. Let's eat some food. And take a look at the card. I need to make a cauldron. I need to make a mine cart. Um, oops, crap. All right, I will admit that my blood uh, is pumping a little quickly at this moment in time and that I'm not kind of fully making brilliant decisions here. Uh, but that's okay. We'll, we'll settle back in. Uh, I've not found a spawner yet. I guess I haven't really done a whole lot of caving. Kind of just jumped down into this ravine and nearly died a dozen different ways. Uh, all right, but we did that. Um, I never made the uh, book, so let's go ahead and do that. And then we're going to have to update the card so I can see what else kind of remains. I'll go ahead and turn this into sugar just to help remind me that I kind of want to do that. And by now we should have enough for the golden apple. Uh, so let's go ahead and craft that before we update the card, just since I happen to know that that's there. All right, and how are we doing? Uh, I'm going to need some shears. We're going to need to go back up on the surface. I still need to find the mushroom. I never found the clay. Uh, we're going to need the uh, gravel thingy. And a compass is something else that I can go ahead and make. So let's make that. And let's make the shears. And I still have one iron left for the, uh, what do you call? Okay, so, and we'll have some gold here. Okay, great. So, I think we are ready to go back upstairs. Uh, hopefully we'll get up there while there's still some uh, nighttime left. Let's see, I kind of fell kind of straight up. Let's just see if we can kind of um, cave our way back up, possibly. Um, we might run into an enderman in the cave, and this isn't really going anywhere. Um, a diamond pick might not be a bad idea now if I'm going to carve my way back up. Um, but let's just, let's just try to carve our way back up. And hope for the best. And this is also now, it's very handy that I crafted those torches. Because now we don't have to worry about gravel falling on our head and suffocating us. And dying yet again. Since I seem to be enjoying playing this round very close to death. We're two-thirds the way through. Uh, we still got seven minutes maybe or something. Um, so I still have reasonably high hopes for this. Um, I should maybe have taken a look to see if that was going upwards, that little kind of like sub-cave system there. But I didn't, and now we're moving along. Alright, so on the surface I need to get a mushroom, I need to get pumpkin seeds, I need to get a melon and a, uh, yeah, the melon is going to be kind of dodgy. Uh, we'll continue to try to head in a direction to find uh, that crazy biome. Great. Okay. Once again, torches have multiple uses, that time giving me some breath so that I don't drown. Um, and I thought possibly I'd seen a pumpkin up on the mountainside over here. Oh, and we need to see the Enderman while we're above ground, possibly. Uh, so let's keep our eyes out for a tall man uh, who still has about a minute that we might catch him on the surface up here uh, before it becomes sufficiently light that he'll no longer be spawning. Okay, the orange that I saw was apparently that lava flow. Assuming that I am where I think I am. I thought we kind of came up very near where we just went back down, and so I thought I kind of recognized the terrain. Not 100% sure. Uh, there's a jungle. Okay, great. Um, let's do keep an eye out for the red mushroom. I think I see it straight ahead. Great. Uh, not seeing the Enderman. Not really seeing any mobs. Um, I guess it's... It's not quite light enough, I thought, that nobody would be spawning, especially in the roof roofed forest. Uh, mushrooms in my inventory, so let's remember to craft the bowls at some point. Uh, but let's make our way over to the jungle, find the melon. We can make the glistering melon. Um, which, do you have to surround it with, like, uh, the little bits of gold? I can't even remember. So we rarely get a chance to craft it. All right, and we'll also pick this up. I still don't have the wheat. Uh, we might end up having to grow it. I'm sure I'll find a lower cocoa bean that I can get to more easily. Oh, and there's the pumpkins. Uh, so we're going to grab this cocoa bean, we're going to grab the pumpkins, and we're going to find a melon. All right, so I've got that. Um, right. And then we'll try not to be too manic. I don't know that I got the uh, second piece of string, uh, which is another unfortunate little bit. Um, let's go ahead and make the... Uh, mushroom stew while I'm thinking of it. 
And I think there's a chance that we're going to have to, okay, and I, let's get this in the bar so I can get that, uh, that we're gonna have to craft a hoe and um, uh, get our own, what do you call cooking? And so I'm gonna go ahead and do that right now. Um, I don't have the iron for the buckets to make the cake, but the cake was kind of always a long shot. Um, do I have bones from killing any skeletons? Hopefully I do, so that we can go ahead and get the wheat going for this. Um, but I'm pretty sure I got a couple of seeds. No, I didn't get any seeds because my inventory is filled with crap. Um, so let's get the seeds in the bar. Um, thank you. Uh, do we have bones? We do. Great. So we can go doop 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 Get my wheat, uh, run back over to my crafting table that's still here. We'll craft the cookie. We'll craft the glistering melon. Um, wheat, wheat, cookie. Great. Glistering melon. Oh, I don't have the uh, melon glisters yet. <laughs> Whatever they are. Um, I don't need the apples. I don't need more sugar. Um, I don't need this. I don't need this. I don't need this. Okay, inventory is okay. I didn't need to pick that up because I have another crafting table. We're still looking for the melon. We're still looking for uh, what else? Um, the ender pearl, probably more string to catch the fish. Uh, the uh, I took it just off my bar, um, but we need to grab this. We can get this in the jungle as well, along with the melon, uh, the vine. There we go. All right, so let's keep our eye out for melons. It's one of the easiest things. Do I have this? I still need another string too. So we need to listen for mobs to get into another cave. Uh, and possibly find the ender pearl as well. Uh, let's just look around carefully and see if we can spy melons anywhere. I don't see them. Standing still for a moment. So, oh, and we, I never got this. Um, and I think this will be the last time I'm using a furnace, and so let's just go ahead and stick the furnace down there to get those out. Um, and I don't know if there's anything else that I'm going to smelt. Uh, we never found, right. Oh, I need, I need, um, gravel, the flinty thing that I have my one iron ingot for as well. So let's continue to look for the melons. Um, listen for spiders and try to find a gravel pocket. And in our last two minutes or so, yeah, hopefully we'll be, at least be able to get two more items, the melon and the flint and steel. And maybe if somehow we stumble upon a spider in the next few seconds, might be able to get the fish. I don't have as high hopes for that. Oops, all right. Now I have some high hopes because I hear a spider. All right, let's get the uh, flints first. Since it should be so easy. Oh gosh, how many gravel can one person dig up without getting a single flint? This is, I do believe, my new record. Like, I see people complain about this sometimes, but that was 35 gravel before we got a flint. Uh, that's a lot. Um, and you know what? Eh, no, I could probably kill the spider. Let's, let's go find these guys. Let's kill the spider. Let's get the string and get the fish. Okay, they're right here. All right, they're either below or above. The spider's to the left. The zombie's right here. Okay, here's the cave. Where's the spider? Darn it. Running out of time. I could be making a glistering melon right now. I can't find the spider. Is he really not up here? He's got to be right here, right? Oops. It's going to take too much time to fish at this point. Okay. Spider and fishing is out. Uh, now we just have to try to find the melon. Uh, fishing could easily take 30 or 40 seconds. And I don't have that kind of time to spare. Uh, I did already craft the flint and steel, I do believe. Um, so now we just got to find a melon somewhere. We got 40 seconds or so. That should be enough if we... Well, it just kind of comes down to luck here. Um, I don't think there'll be a melon inside the ravine. The edges of the jungle where there's a lot of grass are good places to look for the melon. I'm worried that I'm circling back around to places that I've already been. Am um, I really not going to find the melon? That's going to make me sad. You guys wouldn't want me to be sad, would you? Come on, Minecraft. The viewers don't want this. Oh, there's the melon. Oh, it's going to be super close. Uh, I don't have a crafting table in my bar. Oh, and I just fell in the water. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm going to be just short. Yep. Darn it. 
Ran out of time to craft the melon. Uh, 18. Oh, and I never made the rail. Somehow I just completely missed that. Um, admittedly, I didn't mine up enough iron to do it, but it's because I thought I had kind of finished up all of my iron things. Uh, and so I just kind of let it go out of my mind. Okay, 20 is definitely achievable on this card. Um, the card was more difficult than I expected at a first glance, I think. Um, although, admittedly, I spent a lot of my time underground trying to just not die rather than getting the mining done that I needed to do. So, yeah, I mean, I don't feel bad about that one, but I definitely could have done better. Ah, all right. But that is our seed of the week, and I love delicious cookies. And who doesn't love gold? Uh, and so I have some wonderful gifts for myself. Let's return to spawn. I will say thank you all for watching Minecraft Bingo this week. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I hope, as always, that you guys are having a great day. And I will see you again with more Minecraft Bingo in the future. Bye-bye.